I would much rather go through a lot of pain and get knowledge at the end of it than avoid the pain and also avoid getting the knowledge. Transhumanism, it's basically the philosophy that we can and should improve human quality of life by the use of technology. How most people think of transhumanism is the extreme end of it. Extra senses, uh, making people cyborgs, that kind of thing. It's, it's more or less the guiding philosophy behind biohacking in that that's what we're doing. We're attempting to use technology in our own personal way to make our bodies better. My first surgical experiment would have taken place in 2007. All I did was order a tag online and a reader and buy some sterile scalpels and a, and a little operation kit. And then a friend of mine who was taking a medical degree at the time wanted to do the actual incision. So we sort of collaborated on that. Uh, she helped me with the incision and then I put the tag in and dressed it up and that. Because your nervous system is just purely works on electronic signals. Um, exact same way as any kind of device. It's just signals traveling along pathways. The only difference is that the pathways in your body are nerves rather than circuits. So, you know, when you put a little node into the nervous system, as long as it generates an electrical signal, it'll hook up to your nerves fine. There's no problem. Hey, wait up. Today's chip is an upgrade from the chip that I have already. It can do more than the existing chip can. So what I'm thinking of doing is seeing if the data from a contactless payment card can be copied onto the chip. Everything's sterile. Um, we've sterilized the surface and our hands on top of and inside the gloves. And now we're going to start. And you can see there wasn't very much bleeding either, but you can see there's quite a neat puncture hole there now. In goes Mr. Tag. We have to give him a bit of a squeeze just to make sure that it goes far enough through the hole so that it won't come back out while it's healing. And um, there we go. There we go, it's spitting out the ID number there. I'm not a doctor. I don't have any medical training. I don't have any medical qualifications. As far as I'm concerned, this is purely something that I do to myself, using my own right over my own body. And I, I don't suggest that anyone else does it. My reasoning for why I don't think it's insane is basically because it has a purpose. There's no other easy way to get this data other than sitting waiting for someone with a research lab or a, a corporate backing to do it. My dream is just to get some data that other biohackers can use in the future that's useful to other people.